Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, I have this really cool talent that I've never shown on YouTube before. No joke, I have never shown anyone through YouTube this hidden talent. Like a few of my family members know, but no one else besides out of my family knows about this hidden talent that I'm about to show you today. No stalling any longer, no putting it back, right here, right now. <clears throat> I can do a sick Optimus Prime impression. Ow! Oh, ow. <laughs> I have a slight blister on my hand, I shouldn't have done that, that was so stupid. <laughs> But nonetheless, I will be doing my Optimus Prime impression after you guys go watch the 2007 Transformers movie, the 2000 some or other second one, and etc. Just watch the crap out of the first Transformers movie from 2007. I'll wait. Watch sign backwards. Ready? Okay, let's do this. <laughs> you guys didn't even click off the screen, did you? Okay. I am Optimus Prime. We must get the Decepticons before they do something extremely stupid. Like, get a giant cube that creates a bunch of giant transformers or small transformers out of any object that's electronic. Then he makes a giant evil army to destroy the planet. And ex that's extremely stupid. So we must roll out. Autobots, roll out. Pretty good, right? <laughs> yeah, this, this took me like several months to do, to perfect. And I think I finally predicted it. Pred pred Perfected it. <laughs> How am I just now stuttering after doing that awesome impression? I don't know. Anyways, anyways, the first thing you need to do to master any impression is to watch the crap out of the movies. I can't stress that enough. If you just are watching this video just for the heck of it and you're like, huh, I need to learn. I want to learn how to do this. What I would suggest click it off now. If you have time to kill, watch a few Transformers clips on YouTube or whatever. Uh, Watch the crap out of the movies. Um, then come back. And now I'll show you how to do it. Now, what you need to do is get your low, you need to lower your voice as much as you can. Really. Just like <clears throat> cough a few times if you need to. Just really talk low. And get lower and lower and lower and lower. Until you get this really cool a narrator voice in a world where all things is awesome. Stuff like that, you know? And just keep practicing that low pitch voice. And then go back to watching the clips. Um, find one line from those many Transformers clips as you can. I think the best line is Autobots roll out. He says that in all the TV shows, all the cartoons, all the movies, all the comics. I don't even know. If, is there Transformers comics? I'm not sure, but whatever. We're getting off track. Um, but yeah, um, go to get a line from any of the movies, any of the TV shows, and just keep pra practicing that line over and over. Listen to it in your head. Listen to it in your head. Listen to it. And replay that line over and over. Until, this may take you a couple months, a couple years. For, for me, whenever I started doing Yoda, it took me like, since 2007 to 2000. I want to say 17. So it took me 10 years to fi fix, finish the, uh, Impression. Now it doesn't usually take that long. No, no joke. Um, I it just took me that long because I'm not that big of a Star Wars fan. 
I wish I was, but, you know, the latest movies, you know, they're just stupid. Like, you can like them if you want, but that's just not me. So, this will take you a while. Like, I want to say a couple months, if the shortest couple years, and the latest. It won't take you, like, just like that. It won't be like that. No, not whatsoever. It'll take you a while. So, after you get that low pitch sound... Like, you, you want to raise it up every once in a while. Like, go, go low, then come high, then go low again, then come high again. Then you do the line. You just keep going up and down, up and down, just like that. Just like that. You want to go low, be as dramatic as possible, then come really high. For a really inspirational speech or whatever. <laughs> then you go low again. Then you go high again. All the bikes roll down. See? Now, another cool thing to do, if you really want this impression to stick, is, and is if you're doing this for YouTube, I recommend doing a sound effect um, app. To uh, make your voice sound like electronical. I'm not going to do it because I don't have one. But if you do have one, great for you. Add it to your voice. Just make your voice as sound as robotic -y, uh, as as much as a robot as possible. Now. And uh, after you pretty much mastered it, that's what I recommend. You really want this voice to stick. Now. After you do that, um, I guess, now, that will only work if you have a, I, uh, if you have an app like that. If you're doing this for YouTube, I recommend getting an app. If you're doing this on a phone call, I recommend, uh, getting a special microphone, or, no, no, it won't work for a phone call. It just won't. Um, oh, I got something. Maybe get one of these giant director horns that you can buy these off Amazon. Maybe it'll give it more of an echo. Any echoing is good. Good for the effect. Autobots, roll out. We must get the Decepticons before they're doing something really stupid. Like, get a giant cube. Yeah, that, that sounded pretty good. So... Get one of these giant director horns. You can buy these off Amazon, eBay, whatever. Um, I don't know what store you would get them at. Um, if you want to do it for a phone call, I recommend doing that. But uh, if you want to do it for like a Fortnite, people like people like to do it for Fortnite videos. Um, get a special microphone, I guess. That it changes your tone into like a robot voice. That will really sell it. But anyways, after you have mastered the the uh, voice, I just want to tell you guys this. Do it as much as possible, even after you mastered it. Because you'll lose touch of the voice. I cannot stress that enough. It will go away after, if you don't practice this voice, Frequently, like sometimes when I'm found at work and nobody's around, I'll just go like on a box, roll out. Just nobody's looking. Just so, uh, like I still have touch in the voice, you know. I don't want to lose it, you know. It's if you want to, like, if it's in something embarrassing like Yoda, um, then yeah, don't do it as often. If you don't like the voice, it's fine, you don't. Well, just make sure it's a character you like. Like, if I learned that the hard way. Whenever I was doing Yoda, um, that was really embarrassing for me. So, uh, like, I don't do it as often. Like, people say, oh, yeah, that's good. Good job. But, like, nah, I, I'm, it's embarrassing for me. Make sure it's a character you like. Otherwise, it's pointless. Waste of time. But, anyways, guys. Thank you so much. Ow, my hand again. Crap. Ow.
But yeah. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like, comment down below, subscribe, keep your notifications on. Peace out, ciao.